Who are you? I wonder what he's doing now. I wish I knew if I was helping him at all. Of course you are. Mario will be fine. You should be proud of your efforts. Mario knows all you've done. And don't worry, Princess. You'll be able to talk to him in person before long. <laughs> I hope you're right, Twink. Thanks for cheering me up. Let's go back to the room, shall we? Oh, Princess Peach! Your cuddly old Bowser's here! Oh, Twink. Can't we have a friendly conversation for a change? Come on, let's see a smile. I have nothing to say to you. Oh, don't be such a pill. You're stuck with me for a long, long time, beautiful. You'd best get better get used to it. Mario's coming, Bowser. If you can't stop him. Ha 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 ha! Oh, you poor silly girl. I'm invincible with the Star Rod, didn't you know? Mario's no match for me. His history, get over it. Your ratch raunchiness! We have an emergency! <sighs> it better be important. I'm right in the middle of a friendly chat with the princess. Ah, Mario sa now saved all the star spirits. There is a chance he could come up here using their power. We must make ourselves ready in case he shows up. Ah, what? Ah, Mario! Okay, listen, Kami Koopa. Send everyone to their posts. We'll ambush him the second he enters my castle. Princess Peach, why don't you come with me to watch? You can have a front row seat to see Mario get crushed. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Tie her up immediately. If she gets out this time, heads will roll! No! Please! You big Koopa! Show me- show some respect to the princess! What is this whining little glittering thing? Confetti? <laughs> Buzz off! Twink! Take the princess! Now, let's move! No! My name is Kama. Mario, well done. Thank you for your coming. You have successfully rescued all of us in Star Spirits. We are in your debt. Now all that is left for you to do is challenge Bowser. My power should help you. To bring back the Star Rod, to beat Bowser, to bring peace back to the Mushroom Kingdom, and to save Princess Peach. Mario Star Energy goes up to 7. Mario can now use Up and Away, a new Star Spirit power. With Up and Away, you can turn all enemies into stars. Mario, you must make your way back to Shooting Star Summit. From Shooting Star Summit, we'll prepare the route to Star Haven. The name of this route is Star Way. Once you travel to the Star Way, you will finally reach Star Haven. Oh, my only wish for you to save this precious world. You can do it, Mario. Goodbye for now. Alright. Guys, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario 64. So, in the last episode, we took on the final of... The final? The end of the Crystal Palace. And faced off against Bowser's final boss minion. Now that we are here, we're finally moving on to take on Bowser. Kind of. I say kind of because honestly we're not going to yet. We actually have something we need to do first. Take this while I'm here, the snowman doll. And honestly, I'm not taking that pebble. It has no use. Leave that for uh, a hit for someone else who comes running. Alright. Let's come running along and just kill these guys. There's no real reason to fight them, but you know. I'm running through here and he was about to hit me anyway. Now with this, beaten. These guys are not even a threat anymore. As you can tell, they weren't really a threat to begin with, and now they're kind of pathetic, even with just the little two levels up. Two level ups? Yeah, I think it's only been two since we uh, first got to this area of the game. I still don't like fighting the piranhas and the gulpits. They're kind of annoying enemies, but all the same, you know. There we go. Now, that's why I'm dodging them, by the way. 
So, like I was saying before, we're gonna have a good old time just doing a little bit of side questing before. I say side questing kind of shakingly, since not all of it's side questing. Um, and also there's gold pits on these ropes now. Because, you know, why not make things more dangerous when I take care of the enemy? Also, I didn't mean to hammer him. I accidentally pressed me. One down, one down. Beaten. Up to 60 star points already. That boss gave us way too many. If we were lower level, man, that's that'd be ridiculous. But now, uh, I feel like there's something else I wanted to do. Oh, yes, I remember. Uh, key items, letters. Mayor Penguin and Merlot at Shooting Star Summit. Minty Cooper. Okay. She's Toad Town, Koopa Village. So, let's go visit the mayor, and then let's head out of the Shiver City. I don't think there's anything else we need to do here. If there is, then I'll show that off probably next episode, as this is just continued on from the previous recording session, and I'm getting a wee bit tired tonight, so I don't think I can do any more. So I'm just not going to look up anymore. Because I do look up some of the items that I don't quite remember. Just as a reminder of things. Mario, I do believe you saved all seven star spirits. Now you always do is defeat Bowser and bring back the star rods so that the world can be peaceful again. And all those poor kidnapped people can come back. I wish to the stars you'll win. Uh, I meant to talk to you with Paracaria. You're Mayor Penguin of Shiver City, correct? My name's Paracaria. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. For me? Oh, it's from Yoshi Village. I don't know where that is, but I bet it's pretty far away. I'll read this later. Thanks very much. Oh, hang on. I'll give you this. Yep, a three star piece once again. So we have see, currently on us 53 star pieces. I believe there's something like 69 or something star pieces, or 72 or something, that are obtainable just finding them. Then there's like a lot through Mer uh, Chuck Quizmo's quizzes. We'll have time to explore all of that a bit later. I've already condemned it, right? Yeah, I did. Just wanted to be sure. I love, I love how the frozen things look in this game, by the way. It's kind of cool. Alright, nothing to do there. Actually, isn't there a... Yes, there is. Go down here. And where does this lead? Yep, sure enough. My good sir, you can't afford without this one. It's worth better than the last one, but for you, it's the price is the same. 64, I, the, the eminent Rip Cheetah, will sleep better knowing that you've bought it, for you are a man of great taste. How about it? Do we have a deal or not? Sure. God star piece. <laughs> well done, my good man. I thank you deeply. Now, if you thought that item was good, I have something even better. Sure. Got a super shroom. Alright. Same price. Got a mushroom. That was even worse, but okay. Um, sure. I'll come back and do more trading with him later. I don't think I've got all the star pieces from him. I don't remember. I know that I got that one, though. So I can mark that one off my list if I had a list on me at the time, but I kind of forgot to grab my papers and whatnot. Uh, what did I want to do here now? First things first, let's check. Actually, no. Let's go back home. And let's see what kind of stats we have currently. We haven't visited my house in a while, so, you know. Mario needs to go home sometimes. And he needs to visit his brother and tell him that, yeah, he'll never be as cool as him. Even if he has, uh, his own mansion and stuff. Pfft, who cares? Mansion was filled with ghosts at one point. Princess Peach is stuck caught up way up there in the sky. Come on, Mario. You're a hero, bro. You have to save her. I really wish I could do an Italian accent that didn't suck! Coins earned 1,098. 
Badges collected, 46 of 80. We still have 34 more badges to find. Great. Star pieces collected, 79 of 160. Tasty's recipes. 2 out of 50. Chuck Wisma's quiz is 7 out of 7 so far. Uh, number of battles, 258. Your first strikes, 90. Enemies, your first strikes, 31. Total power bounces, 28. AKA, the most I've ever done at one time was 28. So, Tasty's recipes will get their own video. Star pieces collected. Uh, we don't have very many left until we're... I th actually, I think it's something more like 100 or something. Because I think there's like 60 quizzes in Chuck Quizmo's quizzes. Oh yes, I remember why. I'll show you guys why in a bit. Give me just a minute. Actually, before we leave this place, now that I think about it, I do have one thing I want to do. I want to come over here. I want to come and read his uh, journal. I haven't done this in a while. His diary since... Wow, that was a while ago. A shy guy appeared at my house the other day. I found him asleep in my bed. Can you believe it? I ran after him, but he was very, but he was way too fast for me. I heard that a lot of shy guys also appear in Toad Town. Supposedly, they came from Shy Guy's toy box. It must be somewhere in town. A toy box. I wouldn't mind seeing that. Maybe they have a Nintendo 64. <coughs> The console we are playing on! The whole Goomba fi family visited me today. They said that Goombario was in care of my brother, then gave me a souvenir. It was a Goomba, a special treat from Goomba Village. It looked so yummy, I ate it without telling my brother. My FP increased by three. You think you'll notice? I heard that my brother went to Lava Lava Island on the tuna. Unbelievable, so unfair. I, I want to ride on a tuna too! I heard that some Yoshi kids on Level of Island got lost and my brother saved them. I bet Yoshi kids are just about the cutest thing around. I'm a bit jealous of my brother. I heard a rumor that I actually have lots of fans. Wow! What a great news! To live up to their expectations, I want to play the lead in on an adventure. Of course, my name would have to be in the title. That'd be sweet, heart. If I know it'll never happen. Aww. I heard that a door appeared in Toad Town. They say it leads to flower fields. I guess lots of star spirits live in that flowery place. Flower fields. I bet their souls are as beautiful as the prettiest flowers. Somebody said to me that a way will open up when you use a scarf in a bucket. What? A scarf for a snowman? Wouldn't it melt him? What? That's not how that... Okay. Yesterday I got stuck in the trap door when I was entering my secret room. Have I been using it too much or am I putting on weight? I better oil it to make sure it opens easier. Oh, okay. So, I don't think there are any more uh, uh, diary entries, but I'll have to look that up. Or, well, I'll check back regularly. I shouldn't look up everything. I should just, you know, have the decency to play fairly. Alright, now back to what I was doing. I'll be right back, guys. First stop, Minty. You're Minty, correct? My name's Parakeet. I don't for letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter duly delivered. The postman's work is never done. To me? Oh, who's it from? The wise Whisterwood? Who's wise Whisterwood? Thank you for making the kind flowers bloom so beautifully. Oh, it's a thank you know, Art. It says, please drop by flower field sometime. Wow, how delightful, Art. But how does wise Whisterwood know, would know about me? Oh, excuse me, I'm rambling. This is a small gift to say thank you for delivering the letters. Please take it, Art. Okay. So that was one of the uh, star pieces that I haven't gotten yet. So let's do it for the last few. Actually, I think like have I? I did not take this out of here. When Mario's in danger, he receives only half the damage. That's extremely useful because it can actually save you if something has a uh, max damage of eight or less. I believe it is, or is it nine or less? Then you can actually survive an attack from that if you're at five. You're more correct. Your name's Perky. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter, duly delivered. The postman's job's never done. A letter for me from Merle in Starborn Valley. Wow, news from my dad. Thanks, Mr. Postman. My dad writes all the time and he worries about me. My sister and my sisters and I are totally bad at writing back, though. Maybe I ought to write him a little more often, huh? This is a treasure that I've been kept a long time. I'm gonna give it to you as thanks. You can always come back and swap me something for it. Star piece. Oh, sweet. Ah, 
Power Plus. Ooh, my neck. After battle with Mario, get twice as many coins as usual. Ooh, I want this. The reason I want this is because I'm gonna have to get a lot of money soon for some things. Yes, I want to swap some more. Um, I cannot believe I haven't bought ZapTap. Or wait, I think I bought ZapTap. Did I not get it when I had replaying the game? Weird. Um, I'm honestly not going to use most of these. I will get the FX badge because I do like the different sound effects. It just kind of spices things up for me. Oh. No, I didn't mean to. I want to actually get some of these badges. Um. Boo. No, I want to scan things. Ooh, that's good. Here, I'm just going to get this. Power Quest badge, it's extremely useful. And just grab the Zap Tap badge since it's worth 10. How many star pieces? Dang. I want you to count up. Thanks for not even showing me what you have. Jerk. Oh well. Well, his uh, star piece was used to buy that Vex badge, which I need to equip right now. I do really like using these. I have A, B, C, and E. I'm missing D right now. I'll have to figure out where that one is. Slow go. I don't know if I showed this off or not. But yeah, this is it. This is it. It makes you unable to just spin at all. It makes you really slow. You're still normal when jumping, but you know. I don't know why you would do that. Maybe as a challenge type thing? But I don't know. Um, okay, turn off the spikes thing, uh, I would not be using flower power right now. Instead, let's do bump attack whenever I touch an enemy who I'd normally kill. Let's just turn that on. And, oh, I'm... Okay, let's see, what else can I turn off? I need four points. Like I said, I would not be using that. I need one more point. No, two more. Sure. Since I don't really plan on getting into battles. There. I would now be able to kill everything I touch and get a lot of money for it. This is extremely useful since I need the money to buy from Richito. Er Chip Rita. I think it's Rip Cheeto. Rip Cheeto. Hoover, I believe, is this guy. It's been a while since I've been shopping in Toe Town. I bet I could read all about your adventures in the newspaper there. You're Coover, correct? My name's Barricade. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. <laughs> no letter. Do you deliver? A postman's job is never done. Hey, thanks! You came at a good time. I was just about to send a letter myself. Oh, we take a look at this. It's a letter from Musty. The two of us are always thinking along the same lines. He's one of my f fishing pals. I'll tell you, if you don't fish, you should. What a hobby. And to think, I was just about to send letters to all my fishing buddies about a trip. Once we have a good place set up, I'll write a letter back to Musty. So, could you send this along for me? Thanks so much. It's a good friend of mine who's always fishing at the Toe Town Port. He's easy to find. Thanks again. Yeah, you can. We've seen that guy before. But okay, I there's something I could start doing now, but I'm not going to. So instead, I'm gonna drop it. Well, I'm back in the village. It's rather nice, eh, old boy? Adventure is all good, well and good, but one's home is really tops. So stay here for a change. I've just had enough of you sitting around worrying and waiting for your return. Hmm? Oh yes. Oh, oh of course. Well. Uh, <laughs> Psst. Tell the truth, old bean. I mentioned a search for the lost palace in the north, but t -t mum's the word as far as the wife's concerned. Oh, okay. I already have found. Please hurry up and beat Bowser, will you? Then maybe Bombette will come back and we'll be quiet. Bombette! Bombette! It's all he ever says. It's so annoying. Oh, Bombette! Shut up! She probably dumped you because you never stopped talking. No, you shut up. 
I offer up on bed as deep like the southern sea. Bomb! Even being dumped constantly won't discourage me, but bomb! Um, uh, Bombette, what do you have to say to this? Do you hear this guy, Bombette? He never ever stops talking about you, but the bomb. Oh, Bombette! Shut up, please! Right now, think about something else for two seconds, will you? You're really starting to get on my nerves! Bombette, I'm putting my whole heart in the next explosion. Watch you to see my true love. Bomb, bomb, big bomb! Oh my gosh. I am so sorry for you. I feel... I'm so sorry. I just... I'm sorry. Well, I think I went back to Perry because, you know, letters and whatnot. So I decided to pop it into here into Forever Forest because I remember I did forget something here. I believe if you head through here. And then around this way. Yep, sure enough. An FP plus badge. It's nothing special or anything, but all the time I wanted to grab it while I was here because I thought of it. <laughs> Something else I forgot. If you head this way from uh, one of the areas, this is an area I never visited on. I'm just, you know, killing things through a force, but if you head all the way around here, and all the way up here in the center, there's an HP plus badge. Pretty cool in my opinion. But, you know, it's nothing special. Let's go. Yes, through here. My good sir, you can't do without this one. It's worth better than the last one, but for you, the price is still the same. 64. Okay, let's buy. A dried shroom. He just keeps getting worse with every one. Okay, another dried shroom. Uh, star base. Alright. I don't know how many star pieces I've gotten through through him. Um, Googled it. Just got the last one from him. Perfect. And now we have one star piece. Amazing, right? All this work we've done. Now, if we head west from here, I know this is a lot of cutting around in this episode, and yeah, it's a lot of work in this, but it's fine. Kinda of feels like I'm losing some frames there. I'll have to check that. Small. Jump, 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 jump. <gasps> oh my gosh. I love to say what a seven she's fishing for different fish. Addressed to a person fishing a port. Ah, that must be you. The name's Paragary. I love your letters. I believe that one for you. Hang on just a moment. I almost forgot to do once. Another letter duly delivered. The person's job is never done. Huh? What's this then? Shiver me timbers, what from Cuba? Musty must have said he wrote a letter too. Everyone's got this fishing bug. Come for a fishing trip. You should come along, Mario. Yeah, that reminds me. I got a favor to ask. Could you deliver this to him? Him? Well, I'm talking about the Cuba tripper who asked you to bring those letter to me. Cuba's the name? Yeah, and take good care. For the love of fishes. Really? I have to... I have to run all the way back to Coover. I'm so lucky that I opened up all these, uh, freaking underground tunnel things. It's been a while since I've been shopping in Toe Town. I bet I could read all about your adventures in the newspaper there. Mr. Cooper? Mr. Coover? Bear Carry here. I have a letter for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Oh, thanks. Cool, it's for my pal. This must have been my answer to the last letter. Thanks for the speedy delivery. Now I can send letters to the whole gang. It'll be great meeting up with all the guys and fishing up the storm. I've already written one. Here, can you take it? It's to, mi to Mr. E, who lives in the desert. He'll most likely be hanging out in front of the toad house. He wears a blue turban. You'll probably notice him right off the bat. Thanks for everything. Great. Now I'm going back to freaking dry, dry outpost. Of all the places I could be going right now, it has to be Dry, Dry Outpost. I haven't seen it rain in ages. I know it's a desert, but it should rain once in a while. We made a wish for the stars for a little moisture, but I guess it didn't help. If this weather continues, it'll it'll get dry around here. You're Mr. E, correct? The name's Perry I deliver the letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. 
another letter. Dear we delivered. The postman's job is never done. Uh, gee, thanks. Oh, looks like an order from Koopa Village. My job is delivering things from Dry Dry Outpost. This guy's a great customer. He always orders stuff. But hey, by the way, will you do me a favor to order this letter the next time you're in Toad Town? It's to Miss T. She lives there. She's one of the three amazing, beautiful sisters. She's normally chatting with her friends in front of the dojo. Thanks a lot. Um, really? One of those traveling sisters who could be anywhere right now. Let's just hope is in Toad Town and not Shiver City. Oh, they're here. I heard that Mario's going to take on Bowser. Let's cheer him on. Yeah, Mario, you rock. Good luck. The stars are now in breeze to save her, Princess Peach. I'm cheering you on, too. Mario, good luck. Woo! I have anything for you. Hi, Felicity. will cheer you on without rest. You're Misty, correct? The name's Farrah here. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter. Do we deliver? A postman's job is never done. Who is this from? I don't think I recognize the return address. Oh well, I'm always getting love letters from strangers. I'm super popular. But enough about me. I'm so lucky and just came now, Mr. Postman. Will you do me a favor? I want you to deliver this letter to the shop owner at Dry Dry Outpost. I order lots of things for the day. They have so much good stuff. It's not easy to see. I'm tired of this. I'm honestly skipping Paracarry's dialogue now. I've read that too many times. Oh, thanks. Yeah, this is an older sheet from one of my regulars. Good deal. She's one of my best customers. She orders things all the time. If health and beauty are what you're after, you can't beat dessert lemons and limes. Desert lemons. Okay. You can find them in the oasis. Oh, if you make juice of those things. Mm hmm. Oh, hang on. I almost forgot. Can you do me a favor? Please deliver over this letter to a boo called Frankie. Frankie lives in a mansion way off of. Oh, come on. I'm gonna buy this one here. Well, Lady Bo is absent. It's our duty as boos to keep scaring people. How would it look if the Boo Mansion stopped being spooky? You're Frankie, correct? Oh, thank you. Oh, great, it's finally in. This is from a guy I know who deals in useful items from all over the world. He's a great eye for items. He has just got something in that I've waited for him for a long time. Oh, it's the coolest thing. Oh, wow, I almost forgot. Can you do this for me? Sorry if it's a bother. There's a toad child in Toad Town named Dame T. Please deliver it to him. He always seems to be playing by the station with his pals. He must like trains. Thanks a boo. It better be a horror letter. I'm gonna scare the pants off him. Because I want to scare the pants off everyone. Come on, little child. I just want to give you a letter. Where are you? Ah, there we go. So you're gonna save Princess Peach, huh? We're all rooting for you. Yeah, Mario, yeah. Uh. Where? Maybe I talked to the wrong one? Your D D uh, yeah, it's always the same thing. I'm sorry, Paracarry, for cutting out your dialogue. Another letter, do we deliver? Put in the jump is never done. Thanks, mister. Wow, I mean, wow, it's an invitation to the Haunted Mansion. I didn't think it would really come. All the kids in Totem were talking about this invitation, wonder if it's for real. But now that it's come, I guess I have to go. Minnie T, are you brave enough to go with me? Uh, you know I'm really kind of busy. Oh, yeah, I just had this greatest idea. It's asked that Yoshi kid from Yoshi's Village to come. You just got a letter from that kid last week, didn't you? You know, the letter from the island. Let's send a letter back to him and tell him about the scary adventure we're gonna have. Hey, Mr. Postman, take this letter to the red Yoshi kid. I should have seen that coming. Whoopee, yippee, hermie! You came back, Mario! You came to hang out with the five! Tell us all about your adventures over the sea! If you do, we'll tell you all the tricks we played while you were away. <laughs> I read Yoshi Kid. Ah, you must be the one. The name's Perry I deliver your letters! I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. <sighs> and now the other, do we do it? The postman's job is never done. Oh, thanks. I wonder what it is. Oh, my pal made up a new game. We've got to play this later. He also wants me to come over to this town and play with him sometime. But how do I get there? 
Oh well, maybe someday I'll be able to cross the sea and hang out. It's really fun because I was just writing him a letter about a game I made up. Mr. Perry Carey, will you help? Here, deliver my letter to the Tokyo Resident Center. <laughs> This. You're Dean T, correct? The name's Sparky. I do the ring letters. I guess we've already read that all. We're reading this exact dialogue again. Well, thanks a lot. You miss faster than the old postman, that's for sure. Hey, Yoshi Kid is really good pen pal, huh? He writes letters, really long letters. Sounds like there's always something to fun way on where he is. Lucky him. We should write back again. Hmm, what do you think we ought to write about? Hmm, I don't know. Let's think about it later. By the way, I want to ask you for a favor, Mr. Perry. Can you deliver this? It's a letter for Uncle Frosty of Starborn Valley. I, I, really? No. 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 Why did I start the side quest now? To freaking Starborn Valley? I guess I couldn't have done it until now, but Jesus, man, no! And we're finally here. I'm not gonna lie, I might have almost died there. Uh, you're not frosty. I believe the blue one's frosty. No, I'm wrong. Maybe it is you. Oh, yeah, let's see where it could be. Oh, yep, it is this guy. I was wrong. Name's Perry I don't read it. Uh... <sighs> I'm being drained. Oh, thank you. Oh, how nice. It's a letter from little Dainty and Minnie T. There's not a lot of rascals. When I visit their home, they always end up doing up to something. They do write me letters often. Nice to get letters. Their mail makes me as happy as mail for my wife and daughter. Oh, yes, I almost forgot. I need a letter delivered. I'd like you to take this letter to Kumbapa and Goomba Village. It's actually a reply to little Kumbaria, but I think your dad could explain it better to her better. Drop it off whenever you have a chance, alright? Thank you so much. This this bothers me deeply. More deeply than you would ever know. I wish I had a teleportation device. Alright, Goompapa, you better have good news for me. It must be pretty gloomy around the castle, huh? I'm sure the people there are depending on you, Mario. The only way to help them out is to beat Bowser and save Princess Peach. Please hurry! Mr. Goompapa, Perry Carry here. I have a letter for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter. Truly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Thank you, sir. Uh, what could we do without the postal service? Oh, how interesting. Letter from Lumbaria. I guess I could open it. I remember she wrote a letter from the other day, and I was really wondering what it was. I see. I guess it was a question. And this seems like the answer. It looks pretty complicated, but I think I understand. I'll tell her all about it. Thanks so much for the prompt delivery. Here, take this. The Lucky Day Badge sometimes makes enemies fail to attack Mario. That was worth it. Okay, yes. <sighs> okay, I'm, I'm going to sleep now. I don't know whether this is the end of the episode or if the episode's continuing, but I'm going to sleep for tonight. I don't care anymore. Good night, guys.